Hello, everyone, and welcome to five days of workout hairstyles and workout outfits. And by workout outfits, I really just mean workout tops because I always wear the same black pair of leggings. Starting off with this first hairstyle, this is probably the most time consuming one, but I think it's so cute and really easy if you don't know how to French braid or Dutch braid. First, start by grabbing a small front section of hair and tying that off with a clear hair elastic. Then you're gonna wanna clip that piece of hair out of the way and then gather together another section of hair right behind that front section. And you're gonna want it to be about the same size, tie that off and then unclip that front section of hair, divide it in two. And you're gonna take each strand and wrap it around that second ponytail. Now take that second ponytail, clip it out of the way. So now you're just holding that very front section of hair and you're going to gather another section of hair with that front section of hair. So it's gonna be three sections total and tie that off in a ponytail. I hope that made sense, but um, you're just gonna keep repeating this. So taking the section of hair that was in front of it, wrapping around and then gathering it together with the section below it. And then once you get to the bottom, you're just gonna wrap it around. So there's really no more hair to add to it. So you're just gonna keep wrapping the strands around each other and tying it off after about an inch of room all the way to the bottom. Once you get to the bottom where you want it, go ahead and tie it all off together. And this is what it should look like. And then go ahead and do the same to the other side. And this is the finished hairstyle. I think it's so cute. You can also pull out the pieces to make it a little bit chunkier. I put on this Skims workout top. It's from their new workout line and I just love the way it fits. For the second hairstyle, we are doing some faux Dutch braids. I'm starting off by just using some oil in my hair and splitting my hair down the middle and then using this wax stick to get down all my baby hairs and flyaways. Divide your hair in two and then tie off one of the sections just to keep it out of the way. And then I'm just sectioning off all the hair that's in front of my ear and tying it in a ponytail. And then you're gonna wanna clip that out of the way and then gather that back remaining section of hair and tie it in a low ponytail. And make sure this is pulled really tight and smooth. Then release that front section of hair and you're just gonna do a basic three strand braid all the way down until you meet that ponytail at the back section of hair. Go ahead and do the same to the other side. And then you're just gonna continue doing another basic three strand braid all the way down and tying it off. And as always doing the same to the other side. And now it kind of gives this illusion of a Dutch braid when really all you did was a single three strand braid. I put on this Lululemon bra with a Halara Bolero and I just think it is so cute. I love Bolero shrugs right now, I'm so into them. And everything that I am wearing, it will be linked in the description box along with all of my hair products I'm using. This third hairstyle is always my go-to because it's so cute and it's super simple and easy to do. So you're gonna start off by tying your hair back in a basic ponytail. And then I'm taking my hair wax stick and slicking back all of my little baby hairs and flyaways. Then starting about an inch down from that ponytail, I'm tying in a clear hair elastic. And then I'm just gonna pull it out a little bit to kind of make it look like a ball or a bulb kind of. And then again, about an inch down, I'm just tying in another elastic, pulling the hair out until I get it to look like what I want. And I just continue this all the way down the ponytail. I think it's so cute and it's so simple and quick to do. Now I'm putting on another top from Halara. I think this one is so cute. I love the little buckle. This also comes in a bunch of super cute colors as well. Number four is a hairstyle I've been seeing a lot of people wearing recently, so I had to recreate it. I actually just saw Kendall Jenner wearing this in season two of The Kardashians. So I'm just slicking my hair back and tying it off in a ponytail. And then I'm just gonna divide that ponytail into three even sections and do a basic three strand braid down every single section. These are my favorite hair elastics. And if you ever see me using a hair elastic, it is these ones. They never break and they're reusable. They're seriously the only ones I've ever found that don't snap on my thick hair. And this is my favorite part. I've been so into hair ribbon recently. I just think it adds like the cutest little girly touch. 
So I tied in a basic black ribbon and this is the completed hairstyle. I think it's so cute. And again, this is another Halara top. I also do have a 15% off discount code in my description box, but this one is by far my favorite. I just love the bow. And for my last hairstyle, we are using some hair tinsel. Obviously I had to choose pink. I'm just looping this hair tinsel on a clear hair elastic and then tying off a little section in the front of my hair with it. Now with that front section of hair, I'm just dividing it into three pieces and French braiding it. This is a really loose, like kind of messy French braid. And then I tie that off after I get to like the bottom top of my head and then join all the remaining hair together and tie that off. And then you get this cute little hair tinsel ponytail. This pink top is also from Halara. I just had to go with an all pink look, like I just had to. Thank you guys so much for watching and follow for more hair tutorials. I'm hoping to start posting on here at least once a week. Bye.